So that's one takeaway with the baseball playoffs. I think the other big one for me, Milliken, he's still back there. How's Dave Dombrowski looking right about now? Pretty good, Milliken. Does his bike work? Is it? No, it's not working. <laughs> I thought Dave Dombrowski just guts systems and kills systems. I thought he, oh, he wins? Listen, I'm talking about Sam Fold there. I think that's been massive for him since going over to the Phillies to help that organization you've already catch given up me on the too analytics. Much. I'm sorry, you've already given me too much. <laughs> John Henry, call Sam Fold. That's all I'm telling you. Who's you can Sam? shut my mic off. Okay, He's what, Dombrowski's what? chief assistant. All right. Was he here? Uh, he was interviewed, I think, for the manager's job here the last time. Well, what? So, uh, Tyler, then you would use the runner up. So you would say that getting that getting rid of Dave Dombrowski was a mistake? I said from the beginning. Was I getting rid of Dave Dombrowski a mistake? A mistake? Yeah. No, I, I think you could have made the right decision with Heim Bloom. I think there were things with Dave Dombrowski you could go and say he wasn't going to be able to maintain that farm system. Working with Sam Phil he always gives you too much. Do that. He always gives you Sam too Fold much. helped him do that. They helped branch that. A guy with analytics who could kind of mix the two. Sam Fold, who's been his assistant or his actual GM over there, the guy that he wants to turn it over to one day, the Red Sox should call him because you can get the best of both. We've been working with Milliken on trying to get him to harness his thought. Uh, <laughs> Mil Milliken <laughs> filibuster is what it is. Why don't you just give credit to the guy who's the architect of the whole thing, Dave Dombrowski. Yes, but I think he had flaws in terms of maintaining a farm system and also making Did? sure that talent went for years. Yes, because when he got fired and the Red Sox farm system was ranked 30th, it's great that Tristan Katsas was there. It's great that Brian Bayo was there. Those guys had no value when he was still here. They were so young in the system, he didn't have the tools to still work from and deal from. I don't care where they ranked. Maybe those rankings are Fugazi. They are. <laughs> make, to make moves at that time and do different stuff to have that flexibility when your you know books were already through the wall you've been over the luxury tax two different times already you needed to reset you need assets to get rid of those contracts i thought they traded assets to get chris sale and traded assets i thought he made a bunch of good trades he did yeah he did he made good trades no one will ever deny that that's dombrowski's biggest strength dumping guys from his system who turned out to not be that good yeah consoles is his guy bayo's his guy there's another one i came across recently i said ooh right uh, rafael the dombrowski guy rafaela well, whatever, oh, maybe it is Raffaella. Or what, what about Wickham and Gonzalez? When was he signed? Uh, well, 2018. Yeah, same ah! as Gonzalez as well. Aha! It was him. It was Wickham and Gonzalez. Listen, it's okay, Milliken. Here's a, in, in, in your development, young man, I'll just give you a bit of advice. Sometimes it's just okay to be wrong and to say it. And then you can move on and it, all the decks are cleared and no one can hold anything against you. And it's just, all right, got it wrong. Dombrowski, Dombrowski was pretty good. They never should have got Ratner. He was good. I never said David Dombrowski wasn't good. I oh said, did I worry oh that he was going to be able to maintain a farm system and get you, them there with all their limitations? You and your ill That's where I was. Kill Dombrowski. It's okay. I was so okay. did I, though. Yeah, so did I, too. I was wrong. See, Milliken, try it. I Listen, I've told you. I've admitted my wrongs on High Bloom. I've said it again and again here. But saying that David Dombrowski at that time where they were absolutely spent, they had gone over the luxury tax multiple years, and they needed to load off some of those assets, no. Dave Dombrowski needed help in that sense. He was, High Bloom was too far in the other direction. Dombrowski's clearly. terrific. It's proven. It's the scoreboard. Fact, not opinion. You were wrong. Just say it and move on. I tip my cap to Dave Dombrowski. And I think Heim Bloom was in the wrong direction, and that's where I'll admit I was wrong. I have much faith in Heim Bloom. <laughs> Jimmy's about to cut you off. Milligan, you think it's bad now? Wait, wait to see what happens if the Phillies Tyler, the Braves. repeat after me. I was wrong. That's it. It's so simple. I was wrong about Heim Bloom being the guy. Oh! Oh, that's, that's movement. Well, that's a half a step in the right direction. And I have it nice and clean, too. He hasn't done that yet. I haven't heard no, he hasn't done it on no, but that he hasn't done it on midday, anything. That's embarrassing. Dombrowski's it's good. terribly embarrassing. D D Dombrowski's track record is excellent. Mm -hmm. I mean, I, I, I don't know if there's another guy I'd rather have. Hall of Fame general manager. I don't have it in front of me. W where does their system currently rank? Phillies? Yeah. Oh, I don't even know, but I'll, I'll find out for you. I don't know. They're in the playoffs about to play the Braves. Who cares about the farm system? Let's worry uh, about the major league roster. I'm just saying, you know, like he's supposed to gut your system. I... He allegedly gutted the system, and yet all your good young players are his guys. So it, it really does, and it ranked low. So I don't even. It, what does it matter where the Phillies currently rank? They probably have it wrong too, because his reputation is that he guts systems, and so the freaking nerds are like, why? Well, you know, this guy is a good farm system. And so they, you know, they look at his prospects through a certain lens, and probably downgrade his prospects because he's Dombrowski. To him, any day of the week, any day. That to me is as big of a takeaway. It, it's two. It's twofold. The, the, the Rays and the Brewers and teams of that ilk keep going down and going down hard. And Dombrowski keeps winning. So, I don't know. Feels like it'd be pretty fun to be a Philly fan. You know, that building looks like it'd be a pretty oh, good take. Awesome. I mean, isn't that unreal? I don't know, because it's also at some point Milliken's supposed to be fun. What an environment. Jesus. But nope. Nope.
consult your spreadsheets, dude. Oh, so it's good to see Dombrowski. He I... just waved you off. Oh, I know. <laughs> Check... Now we can just dismiss you. Check the data. Oh, would it wouldn't be really... It, uh, boy, it feels like being a Philly fan would really suck right now, doesn't it? 23rd, Phillies. Oh, it's, well, huh. Well, they're going to be on the uh, tax. There's, there's a tax implication. Yeah, this was their whole thing. They waited around so they could go over the tax multiple years. When you walk into Aaron Nola and Zach Wheeler and JT Real Muto, life's nice for you, isn't it? What do you mean, walk into? These were there. They were already there. Oh, I see what you mean. He, he had them loaded. He got there and he had to push them over. That's what Dave Dabrowski does well. Does he main te maintain teams well? No, that's a struggle for him. And it goes through track record. You can check through his other stops where that's been a problem. Detroit felt like they made the playoffs like five straight years or something like that. They did. They should have won. And they would have won a World Series if it weren't for David and, Americo Ortiz. And here, I don't think they ever had a losing record with Dombrowski. And this is two straight for Philly or is it three? Either way, two, I think, two. Yeah, I, I, it's just, it, it's okay, Milliken, to have it wrong. It's okay. Like, free yourself, dude. It, you, trust me. You'll be, you'll be better off as a press. It's just life advice for you, young man. Tigers have been in a rebuild since he left. They are still trying to recover from everything of the, you know, when they went yeah. fully and pushed in. You know what? I'm yeah, not I sure. would have kept him. I'm not sure he would be better off as a person. <laughs> <laughs> We're starting baseball. Uh, don't you miss Dave Dombrowski? Are we doing more Milliken going forward, or can we send him home? No, go home, please. Oh, exactly, yeah. <laughs> I'll open the door for you. And look at yourself in the mirror. 617-779-0985. When you need an electrician, call Coleman. It's electric. <laughs> we got a lot of hate for uh, Milliken on this show, and we got a lot of Milli uh, hate for uh, Maz's Tears. <laughs> Sounds like a good show. Exactly, yeah, perfect. We'll start with the Milliken hate. Uh, comment line, Milliken. And I love, so the email's are great because we get spellings, you know. Like, how would you spell Milliken? <laughs> not how these people spell it. <laughs> no, definitely not. M-I-L-L-I-K-A-N. Oh, yeah. not too bad. Too close. K-E-N. M-I-L-L-I-K-E-N. Is how oh, that is? Oh, All yeah. right, so pretty close. Milliken. Spare me. Can I just say you're killing me with that dork that can't admit defeat? All of our worthwhile prospects came from Dombrowski's time. Any bloom prospect, prospects that do pan out are because he drafted higher than any GM in recent Red Sox history. Firing Dombrowski is one of the most short-sighted things this ownership has done. I bet Henry would probably tell Milliken he's wrong. Oh my god, go f*** yourself, right? Thanks. Signed Kent P.S. Jim Murray is suspect. Okay. I don't know about that. Subject line, Milliken is wrong. Spare me. Boy, 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 Tyler Milliken needs to come to reality. Dave Dombrowski has the Phillies in prime position for the future. So admit it, Milliken, you are wrong, Tyler and Greenfield. I was wrong about Heimblum being the guy. Uh, subject line, Milligan is an idiot. M I L L I G A S. <laughs> like Milligan. <laughs> that one in the woods. I'm taking a Milligan. <laughs> Spare me. Milligan is an idiot. Michael, what the F is this kid talking about? <laughs> Look at Dombrowski's track record. Of what winning World Series? Is he freaking serious? I thought that was the whole point of sports, is to win the World Series, and that's the only track record that matters. So his spreadsheet of formulas is freaking irrelevant. Here's a quick spreadsheet for him, though, T-H-O. Track records, Dombrowski, two. Nerds, zero. Tell Milligan, M-I-L-L-I-G-A-N. <laughs> I love that. To go back to math class, freaking nerd loser, it's frustrating. Oh, my God, go f*** yourself, right? <laughs> Milligan. <laughs> 